Well, we're very excited to get funding from Genome Canada and the support from OGI uh, in terms of doing a project looking at novel biomarkers uh, that will help us uh, to diagnose and uh, treat patients with heart failure. And uh, so the big challenge that we have today in health is the fact that heart failure is the number one killer in uh, cardiovascular disease. And in fact, one in five Canadians will ultimately succumb to heart failure. And the biggest challenge is that many of us, you know, may be at risk for heart failure, but we don't even know about it. And so the question is, how do you actually diagnose early? And how do you actually get the right treatment for the right patient? Uh, this uh, partnership came about uh, very much because of the opportunity created by Genome Canada because of this uh, request for application. And when we were discussing and looking for partners, you know, to help us to do the research, Roche Diagnostics, and we came together uh, because of the fact that there was a funding opportunity for us to actually work together. The other uh, aspect in which this partnership came together very successfully is really through the help of uh, Ontario Genomic Institute and the wonderful staff uh, here at OGI. And this is because of the fact that in the very process of application, which is extremely competitive, uh, is the fact that we were able to get tremendous guidance in terms of how to actually engineer this partnership. And the fact that we're successful is very much the learning process we have incorporated every step of the way in the application process helped by the OGI team. And so we're very grateful and still continue to work with the OGI team to make sure we're successful at the end. The overall GAP program, I think, is really a game changer from the ability to bring private sector partners with academic partners to really address this issue of how do we implement personalized medicine so that we can actually treat our patients appropriately, effectively, and cost-effectively for every Canadian in the country.